Hi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know it's been a delay since my last video and I will be getting up the eyebrow tutorial very soon. This is just a video to show you some subscription boxes and some beauty hauls that I've done recently. So today I'm going to start it off with my beauty haul from the range. So first I'm going to start it off with this spray. This is one of my all time favourites at the minute. Um, I did buy two but... As I said, this is my favourite and I've started the second one. It smells a bit like Parma Violets. So that's that one. Put that there. So I bought an eyebrow set and then an extra eyebrow gel because I'm running out. So this is in the shade, I think, dark brown or brunette. I'm not sure the name of it. That's what that looks like. And I have bought these two palettes as well. Let's pop that down there. So that is what that looks like. That is a pressed glitter, I believe. So you've got some burgundy shades, sort of brownie shades, goldeny shades just there. You've got a silver there some purpley ones down here it's a very neutral warm tone palette at the same time so you could create quite a few different looks with that i reckon so that's that one it's also got a glittery lid which i quite like that's that one Put that over there as well and then you've got this palette as well. This is a highlight, baked highlighter palette by Sunkissed Glitter Glow. So these are the shades. It's a bronzy one. So you could use that for shimmery bronzer. That would be too dark for me. As you can tell, I'm quite pale. This one I would love for the inner corner of the eye. Still could use that on the cheeks use these on the cheeks but as like a shimmery blush so that's that one so that's that beauty haul then we have one from beauty bay so there's this lipstick that i got from jeffree star so if i can get the lid off this is galaxy gold so that's the shade it's got a lot of shimmer in there and that is the colour beautiful colour very out of my comfort zone should I say but it was on a deal for nine nine pounds something i believe so i thought i will get it then i have this from violet voss it's a loose highlighter in the shade enchanting so i can't really see it that well let's catch it on the light that's the shade show it from that angle as well very pinky purpley shimmer to it. So that is that one. Just put it back in the packaging. Then we have concealer that I bought. A sample beauty erase and a boost base in the shade 2. So that's what that looks like. It says it's very full coverage, which is always good want to cover up the bag so this is a liquid eyeshadow from beauty bay brand beauty bay and that's what that looks like it's got pinky purpley 
even a hint of bluey green shade in there. It's in the shade Fluorite. That's that one. Did grab two of them. The second one. It's in the shade Peach Quartz. So it's very corally, peachy, pinky tone. Can't wait to use that one. So you can use them. I believe on your eyes and you can even put a colour on top if you don't like how how the colour first comes out so I got this brush from Beauty Bay and it says it's the best angle brush so that's how that comes out stipples look very very nice and it's super soft so you would I would use that to bring the colours in the crease. So I would use it in a circular motion. Just around the crease. That lot. So I'll pop that over there. Let's see how to make my and stamp it up. I've also got this Revolution Beauty Ball. It gives you this little card. You can just look through it and it will give you a little code you can use on your next order. And then it's showing you what they've recently just come out with. So these are like body oils, bronzers, the brushes to add the like oils on with and then it came out with some stay at home beauty and it just shows you on the back there what you've ordered so first i've got a pink grapefruit brightening makeup fixing spray cannot wait to try that Hydration Boost Watermelon Moisture Gel. So that's what that looks like. Can't wait to try that. I've been told it smells amazing and it works very, very well. I've got a Makeup Obsession Brow Whiz. It says it's so fine brow pencil. For a precise brow in the shade so it's not focus don't know whether it wants to focus I don't think it's going to focus but it says brown and I've got an avocado primer with avocado oil Probably should have taken all the cellar tape off the packaging first. So that is what that looks like. So it is a pump. Then I have the Revolution Luster Highlighter in the shade Golden Rose. Take that out. 
believe it's meant to look like a rose. There we go. So just do a small swatch. So that is that shade. There we go, pigmented. Cannot wait to try that on my cheeks. So that is the first and second swatch. Still highly pigmented on the second. So this is the first swatch, the second swatch. Or it's just left over on my finger. So next, I'm going to show you the Peach I Heart Revolution highlighter. It looks like a peach. So it's got a pinky, warmer tone here, and it's got a golden tone there. So if I swatch the pinky one, it's that one. Is that one? If I swatch them alongside each other, so that is the pinkier one, and that is the golden one. I'll have to say the pinkier one isn't as pigmented as the golden one, but still, they will work well. They would work work really well together. I can't get work my words out. Then we have two I Heart Revolution Taste Peachy lipsticks in the shade Delight and Fleur. Fleur. I will swatch them both so this So this one is Delight, this is Fleur, so I've also got, this one's a browny shade and this one's more of a pinky undertony shade, don't know, how, don't know why the camera's not focusing 100%, there we go, so we've got these set of Roxy lipsticks. It's the lip collection. They're in the shades New York, London, and Tokyo. So that is that box. into this look incredible feel gorgeous subscription box as you may know i have unboxed one in my previous 
videos. So first, I have a MAC Muse eyeshadow collection by Mimi. They are cruelty free and vegan. Just states there on the box. It's got 12, oh, if I can open it, 12 eyeshadows in there. So these are the shades. They are all matte ones. They're very nice, warm, neutral, but also dark, cool tone ones. You could create quite a few different looks with them. They're all neutral ones. There's like, these two are the only ones I would believe are giving pop of different colour to it. So that, and you've got a nice big mirror as well. Yeah, there you go. Got a nice big mirror as well. Don't mind my reindeer. That was from Christmas. Let's pop that in that box over there. Now I'm going to go on to the Bare Minerals Crystallised Glow Stick um, in the shade Iridescent Quartz. I don't know whether you can see that. No, I don't think that's going to look. It's not going to um, focus. Anyway, this is what it looks like. This is the shade. It's a beautiful, beautiful shade. It's got sort of a golden shimmer to it, but also at the same time a pinky shade. Pinky shimmer, I mean. So let's put that away and pop it in there. I also have the Kat Von D Ultra Ink Liner Trooper Black Flexible Felt Tip Liquid Eyeliner. This is what it looks like. Very, very fine point. Easy to work with. And if you want a thicker line, you can also do that too. In there. That's my favourite type of eyeliner. I do have the mini collection with the lipstick as well, but I can always show that in a different video. So I've got this Dior Addict Lip Tattoo Longwear Colour Coloured Tint. It's in a very bright pink shade, and it is called. I can't Double eight one natural pink. So that is that one. And that is a swatch. There go. That one. I do love my Look Incredible boxes. They do not disappoint. They are probably one of my favorite one of my favourite subscription boxes. So that is it empty. They give like a nice like pink. Almost what you would use for a rabbit's bed. I do not know why that just popped into my head but oh well. Then we have this glossy box wild thing edition. So that is what it looks like on the outside. This is what it looks like when you open it. You get this little leaflet for a Vision Direct. There's something missing from your handbag leaflet. So that is always 
handy getting those little nips nip bits in there so this is what the leaflet looks like it says explore your wild side and it gives you a list of everything in there or what you could possibly get and then it gives you a sneak peek of june it's a it's a Huda Beauty eyeliner. It says in June we're traveling around the globe to discover a world of beauty beyond our own borders. Your first sneak peek, a long lasting waterproof and smudge proof jewel ended eyeliner brought to you by Iraqi American beauty guru Huda Katana worth £18. It boasts a liquid liner on one end and a creamy pencil on the other allowing you to create endless eye looks and that is what that looks like doesn't want to focus me today so that is that so let's dig in so we get a nice lovely looking packaging there lovely full black look on it I love the gold going throughout. So this is what it looks like on the inside. So first off we've got a UB True Glow Skin Illuminating Stick. There's a shade. I don't know whether it has a shade. I'll look for the shade. So this is what it looks like in the shade one universal light so it comes with a nice cute little cap so if you lose the lid it's the end of the world that is what it looks like So there it is just there, it's not, got, it's not got a massive amount of pigment but it would work lovely under foundation, just gives you a nice sort of natural glow and that is worth £16.20, says it is the full size. That's not too bad. I've already got my money's worth with just that one product. So then I will go on to this Wild Things eyeshadow palette by Steve Laurent. It says it's also the full size. So these are the shades. It's a lovely neutral palette. It's got some pops of little bits of pink. It's got a golden shade there. It's got a silver one there. It might be nice in the inner corner. And it's cruelty free. It says here that it's worth £31. So I've almost got quadruple my money's worth. that one you've also got this dr paw paw outrageous orange balm multi-purpose soothing balm with natural paw paw for lips cheeks and cosmetic finishing with a hint of tint fragrance free cruelty free and vegan so that is that looks fairly big so I do believe this is the full size as well and that is $6.95 so that is a decent price for the size and then 
we have a hair mask, scalp treatment and miracle shampoo three in one formula. Repairs your hair, strengthens hair, hydrates hair, moisturises scalp and dandruff control. So there's that one. That is a very big size as well so I do believe this is the full size. It's not tested on animals. Paraben and sulfate free natural ingredient. So I cannot wait to try this on my hair. And I do believe this is £21 as well. I do think this may be a little bit pricey for it, but who can complain when you're getting it for a £10 box? And then last but not least, we have a bamboo charcoal detoxifying and pore tightening mask. You get one use out of it and I believe it is cruelty free, I'm not too sure. It doesn't say whether it is and I believe this is four pound so it is a full face mask so it's not bad for the price don't know whether it's bugging me that i don't know whether it's cruelty free And that is all of the subscription boxes and beauty hauls that I've done. And this is the leaflet for the end. I do like to keep hold of these because these do look so cute. I do like to keep hold of the boxes as well because you never know when they could come in handy. And there is just one small little thing that I would like to add on. Well, there I had two presents brought for me from one from my mum just I've been feeling I was feeling down um a couple weeks ago so she got me this makeup revolution avocado palette it's 100 percent fresh it says and there's 18 shades of intense pressed pigments I do believe I may have showed this in another video, but I'm not too sure. But I just wanted to say another thank you to my mum. I do love all the greens. They are, they are absolutely beautiful. Different tones, warm tones, even some bluey kind of greens in there. And then that is that palette. And then my partner bought me a palette. One that I've been looking at for quite a while. Oh, I can't just have the packaging. Get out the packaging. So that is this palette. I do love the colours in it. It's got such neutral tones it's got some warm tones on this side it's got two like no it's got about four pops of color i would say so these two maybe this one and that those two there so it's got a nice big mirror i love 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 love, love the colors in it this side is more of a warm tone it's 
pops of colour in the middle and then neutral colours just on the end. I do love that palette and I'm so grateful that he bought me it. So yeah, that is the end of this video. So that is the Jeffree Star, no, Morphe X Jeffree Star palette. And then that is all the goodies that were bought. this palette here thank you for watching guys i'll be i'll be next on with the video hopefully in a couple of days hopefully with the eyebrow tutorial and maybe a contour tutorial let me know what you would prefer to see um first a contour or an eyebrow tutorial even on how um how i do my foundation let me know what you would like to see next thanks for watching bye guys